and then this is just like having a contrast between the lines going this way and then the lines going that way inside. Or could it be like from our research we found that the designs were very simplistic and we wanted to convey that in the, our pop so we decided to choose the second one minus the red lines because it conveyed the simplicity. temper to the clay and use the traditional Iron Age technique of coiling to build the pot. Okay. You've got the, an open top when it's quite shallow and then you've got the top showing. Okay. Yeah. 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 Definitely. Or maybe like again something like ritualistic. Yeah. Absolutely. Maybe like a really special. Yeah. Because I was looking up um, when I was looking up like the stuff uh, about just general things in my age. So there are lots of like ceremonial gifts you give in like in marriage and like yeah. Like it could be something like that. Brilliant. So you're gonna put any like glazes or paint on it or anything? Well, the Iron Age pots didn't really have any like slips or glazes. They mostly just had like decorations. Go. Originally, when we were looking at designs, we wanted to include these semicircles, but we were unsure if they had cultural significance. We're trying to look up, we're trying to look them up, looking at runes, and we thought maybe it's to do with the moon, but we weren't sure. So we let we let that go. But um, we spoke to student advisor. Totally fine. We didn't, so we didn't, we didn't want to like be rude. So we, we're using the semicircles, and we've added in some Iron Age classic zigzags and some lines. What type of bowl were you guys going for? We were going for an um, an omphaloid bowl, which is like it's like a W basically. Okay. Um, and so we tried to make a we tried to do that with the sponge. That didn't work. But the reason it's so wide. Well, we didn't want it to make it so wide, we wanted to make it tall and narrow. And we made the base the right size, but we were using coils, and that went out too far. Does that make sense? Does that make sense? Yeah. Um, yeah, and it's just it's a bit too flat, it's not what we wanted. So, but we're happy Was that, that because the walls were not that stable? or Yeah, a little bit. It a little bit. We tried to make the base and the walls at the bottom quite thick. So that like it wouldn't like gravity wouldn't have an effect on the top walls, but um, but yeah, it just it didn't go the way we thought we were gonna go. But we're we're happy with it. But we're gonna try and make a smaller size bowl vase uh, vessel. So in in the way we want it to go. Yeah. Cool. Great.